The 111th conference of the International Labour Organization has ended with adoption of a new apprenticeship standard among other key decisions. TVC News senior correspondent Sharon Ejasan gives us details in this report. After two weeks of intense deliberation and strategic consultations, the 111th Conference of the International Labour Organization, ILO, ended in Geneva, Switzerland. Several adoption and resolutions were made at the conclusion of the conference. One of this is a new labour standard aimed at supporting opportunities for people of all ages to reskill and upskill continuously in the rapidly changing labour market. At the end of the conference, newly elected chairperson of the governing board of ILO, Richard Adejola, presided over the meeting of the body. Delighted and honoured to assume the leadership on behalf of the government of the Federal Republic of Nigeria as the next chairperson of the ILO governing body for the 2023-2024 session. We appreciate the thoughtfulness in nominating and confirming Nigeria. Speaking of the expectations from ILO members, Ati Jola thanks them for the confidence reposed in Nigeria. He promised that the trust to be respected with all sense of responsibility. Our agenda in future meetings should take on broad challenges such as these to confront and shape global discourse as a matter of urgency. Our policy outcomes and decisions should inspire hope for a better quality of life and new opportunities. We are ready to deliver on the mandate entrusted to us, prepared to serve. The Deputy Director General of ILO says the development will foster growth across the globe. There was absolute uh, great uh, endorsement of the Global Coalition for Social Justice, which is an important initiative of the Director General, Mr. Gilbert Ongbo. And, and the essence of the Global Commission on Social Justice is to make sure that issues related to social development, social justice, are at the same level or receive the same level of attention as economic issues and environmental issues. The governing board is the highest decision-making organ of the International Labour Watch body. Abiodun Richard Adejola is also the Nigerian ambassador to Switzerland. Nigeria will lead the ILO governing body from June 2023 to June 2024. Sharon Jason, TVC News, Geneva, Switzerland.